you're part of it for the intro. What's up you guys? Okay, a lot better mood in this video. Thank you so much. You, the, is that good? You're part of it. You had your moment. I'm sure you'll have more. The last video, I almost didn't post it. It was such a difficult video to not only film, to re-go through and re-watch it, but the, the feedback that I've gotten from it, the comments and everything just honestly made it not only worth it, but in a weird way kind of helped. I did go through a couple similar, which like crazy enough, if you saw the video and you know what happened throughout that video, went through it all again another day after, like we put another offer on a house, it fell through. So like in one week we went through that twice. So that was, it's been a lot, but I'm, in such a better place. We're heading to Florida. I'm just putting some finishing touches on the house today. I'm gonna to clean everything up, do a little bit of packing and work on my glow up. So that's what's keeping me afloat right now. You guys have helped so much. I've put together this like, kind of stemming from the last video, I put together this like one to one challenge where there's 121 days from September 1st until the end of the year. And like, what if you can walk into your Christmas parties and like New Year's Eve, like feeling tight and feeling right and just happy. And can the theme just be that we have freaking fun? Like we just have fun. On the 27th of August, I'm gonna be doing a five day live series where we're prepping for the final quarter of the year and just getting ready to freaking glow up. I'll give you the list throughout this video and we'll just like go through it together, the pre-prep list. But there's gonna be a lot more on it. And basically the premise is that you can pick and choose what you wanna do every single day, no matter freaking what, from now until the end of the year, and you glow up. You look better, you feel better, you're more confident. Bring up the levels of serotonin. So let me take you through my morning, what I did, because I just got off of a pretty big meeting with the Daily Grind. Let me not show you anything in the background. And we're gonna get ready for our day. Like you guys need a sneak peek, since this will be launching semi soon. A lot of people are concerned about when the Halloween collection is gonna launch and if it'll be too close to Halloween, we're not playing you like that. Like we started working on this in freaking summer. It is summer, but early summer. Last video I showed, I mean, now you can see it. This is my planner with the discs. We kind of leveled up the discs. So this is the back. We're just, we're going full tilt right now. It's a full moon tonight and all the weirdos are out. This is the front. It's my fall front porch. Now I've shown way too much and the Daily Grind team is screaming from their desks. And this is another disc. And now because I can't stop, this is another color of discs. So the discs have their appropriate covers. I see this is the problem. I start sharing and I don't know when to stop. So we have, let me just show you like a corner of it, like a little, little, little side of it. Got the purple discs with the purple cover, black and white. This is my favorite launch I've ever had ever. I'm not kidding. And then we have dividers, which that's where we got to draw the line. We listen to you guys and they're thicker. Okay, that's all I can say. That's all I can say. So I'm gonna tidy this up. I'm packing that in my luggage to go to Florida. Ready? We're tidying. That's glow up number one. Live in a tidy space, no clutter. Like not an excess of stuff, like declutter your space. Less things to dust, less things to put away. It just makes life so much easier. I love it. So there's a declutter video, an organized video, and then there's a like deep clean, gnarly, nasty, like hair in the drain video. So that would be step one is like, get your life together with like just decluttering your space and you'll feel lighter from the inside out, I think, cause your environment reflects how you feel. And on that note, I am gonna declutter. amazing so I guess I could share without saying anything and if you can read the label then you'll figure it out can you read what that says you're welcome yes yeah, smells good the team's gonna kill me okay step number two so make sure your space is clean that's number one declutter your life put stuff away clean off the countertops I, I've used that method cleaner for years and by the way can I just I shared this in the last video and like I get it as a content creator you kind of tend to overthink things but it's because Things are, things either get taken out of context or like people fill in the blanks on stuff. All that to say, the reason that I share where things are from is because it is the most asked question in the comments. Where is, where is your outfit from? I will link it. Where is the cleaner? Like it's all things that get asked. So I'm, I, I'm, I try and balance between, obviously it's not a sales pitch. Like I don't care what cleaner you use. I just like that one. And I try and be accommodating that. So it's this weird balance of trying to do that. So I hope it never comes off as like, this is this and this is this. It's literally just what I'm using. Like I keep seeing questions about like, what is the candle in the background? Like I can't tell you, 
but now you know. The second thing, once your environment is clean, smells good, and you're happy with it, and I'm gonna continue to do that today, so you'll see me do that throughout the day because the videographer is gonna come, they're gonna do like a 3D view of our house for the, for the listing and whatnot. I already, I took the pictures, which made me really happy. Um, so that went well, and it'll be listed, and that's that, which is, kind of a huge, like I said in the last video, like a very big transition, which I'm kind of trying to wrap my head around because we do really love our house. My goal, simply put in the glow up challenge is literally like as simple as possible and do those things every freaking day if you can. Two of these a day of water. I will show you how I do the water. I'll also include this in like the toolkit. I'm probably gonna do like a full layout, like detailed layout in my lives as well. And that's all for subscribers, by the way. What I'm gonna do is put in the toolkit, I'll go live, but I'll show you guys a couple things today so that you can kind of like be a part of this now. But the way that I make my water, and it might seem weird how, to, how I make my water, but once you start drinking water this way, it changes the game, okay? So this is already empty. This is 40 ounces. And by the way, I know that you see a lot of people on the internet have like with these cups, and you know me as like, if you follow for any amount of time, you know I'm like the cuppy girl. I have stuck with this cup right? You've seen my videos all year for the whole year so far. So I feel like that speaks volume. So yes, the hype is real. Again, I have no investment in this cup. I'm just telling you, yes, I do like it. So I linked everything from the glow up challenge that I'm doing and that I love from facial tools, skincare, everything. I've linked it in my bio. I'll link it down below too, so you can actually have like the full PDF. And then anything like this, I'll also put in the, the little beautiful graphic that I did. How basic can we, let's make water, but it really does make a difference if you want some glow and skin. Fill with water, preferably filtered if you can, but here we are. Pink Himalayan rock salt, get it from a good source. You don't need a ton, a little bit. Now I could cut a fresh lemon. I have some in the fridge but we're all about practicality and making the glow up challenge easy. This is literally how I make my water. Lots of ice, full 40 ounces, tiny splash of fresh lemon juice. Don't get like a crappy brand, get at least a good brand if you're not gonna squeeze a fresh lemon. Pink Himalayan rock salt. What it does is it basically makes the water like that much more hydrating. And I'm telling you, at first it might be jarring and then you get used to it and you're like, dang, but I want the, I want the little bit of salt in it. And don't put just like table salt, pink Himalayan. To me, it tastes better and you get used to it. And it's like, you literally crave it that way. I got a lot of questions this morning on Instagram. So I'll go through supplements with you guys. Cause that's next on the list. This morning I made my coffee. I will include this in the toolkit, but I'll also tell you guys how I'm going to make my coffee, especially headed into the glow up challenge. I'm not making it this way right now. Right now it was just black coffee, a little bit of creamer on the side. So that while the coffee is brewing, what I do for Andre and I, I brewed in this. I love this French press. I get it. It's from the same brand as the cup. Again, not invested. It's just what I use. I do straight up black coffee in that. I don't mess around. I do a little bit of creamer and I mixed the creamer with a hand frother. So I cleaned this cupboard also whenever we did our deep clean, I organized it. So we just have a few cups. I have my, my kettle and then my frother is here. So this little frother, you can get them on Amazon. And what they do is they will froth your drink or your cream or whatever. But if you have a collagen like this one in specific, specifically, which I just started taking this and it is specifically unflavored, but that's not the reason I take it. It has hyaluronic acid in it and melon extract. And the purpose of it is it targets cellulite. Stop it. So I'm all about that life. So what I did is I created like a collagen creamer for the glow up full disclaimer. I'm not going to put coffee in my creamer creamer. <laughs> If you put, I'm not gonna put creamer in my coffee during the glow up challenge. What I am gonna do, I'm gonna show you exactly how I made my coffee, but I will put the collagen and this will kind of give it that creamy effect. So here's how I'm gonna do it. I do half a cup of coffee, half a cup of tea, but the easier way to make it is you do a full cup of coffee and just steep your tea in the coffee. Don't knock it till you try it. And I got into the best shape of my life doing this because it is like the best, just like, metabolism inducing situation when you start your day. I'm giving you all my secrets. This will deep bloat you. Get this, dandelion root tea. You steep your black coffee in a pot, like just whatever. So I put it in the cup, pour it from the French press into the cup, steep this. And once it's steeped, 
it doesn't really, it'll give it like an earthy taste because it's mixed with the coffee, you don't really taste and you get used to it. Then I'm gonna pour this in, hand froth, that's gonna be my coffee for my glow up. And now I'm literally gonna make this now so you can be a part of my supplements and also my cleanup process. So here's what I would suggest to you. Have like a little drawer or area like this where you do just like a little basket and get them at home goods. And this is how I do it. This one is like hair, skin, nails, collagen. This is like a fat burning pre-workout. This is the pre-workout I'm sticking to. And it's also like a mood enhancer, focus, love that. And then I have probiotics, which I'm just gonna do like this. So then I'm organized, I have my three things, I'm good to go. And then these ones I'm gonna put with my coffee, done. And then these are doubles cause I like it so much I ordered more. <laughs> so this, I'll give you the list like this and then you'll be able to just scroll and save it on your phone. That's a fake kiss. That was a fake kiss. Thank you. So this is what I've stuck to, no problemo. And I think it's because these are like, almost like a candy pixie stick. I have a like supplement version, like a pill version, two bottles that I haven't finished in the cupboard. So I think that speaks volumes. Like if it's not working for you, switch it up. This is freaking working for me. And it's working in terms of consistency, but it's working in terms of my body. I should be a bloated little bunny right now, considering how stressed I've been, my diet choices, like, is not good. The US island is not good. It's getting better, but it's not good. So this has helped. I take this every single day. It tastes like peach rings. I don't really like peach and I still like this because you know why? It tastes like candy. And then you just, you can just enjoy it like you would a candy. Let it dissolve. Then this is what I do every single day. Whenever I go, I'll either do this first, first thing or I'll just do all three in a row. Whenever I go to do my workout or like midday, this speaks volumes. When you get to the bottom of something. Oh, you're still there. I see you. So the way that I started on this is I was just having, I called it my pink pre-workout. It's purple and it's a tea base. Does not taste like tea, it tastes like candy. So this is like mood fat burning. I think it says it. It's like a mixed berry flavor. To me, it tastes like delicious, like sweet blueberries. I love it. Burns fat, controls appetite, increases energy. It gives you like a focused energy and it makes you love how you feel. It literally says it on the packaging. So this is what I started with just this and I loved it. And then one day I was like, well, I have their collagen. By the way, if you see the little chunk parts, that's because it's tea. And when you get a chunk in your mouth, it tastes like a thing of candy. Then I started doing this together. Oh, we're doing like a witch's brew today. And Andre loves it. You know it's a win when your husband likes it. So then I do the collagen pre-workout and that's my juice for the day. So that's my new, takes me two seconds, boom, boom, boom. The glow up to me is all about, like I was just, just so you know, I was gonna go about the glow up on my own and then I shared it in the last video and you guys were like, I wanna do that. I was like, okay, so it's happening. So we're all doing it together. So I'm just gonna share what I'm doing. And this has been working for me and I wanna stay consistent with this from here until the end of the year. I have a discount code with them because I love it so much. Just code Angie B, I'll link it down below. Bundle it if you wanna save and subscribe and then just cancel but if you do the subscription, you can save even more. It's easy to cancel and use the code. I'm gonna sip on this while I clean, and then we're gonna hop to the next phase of our glow up, which I need to check my list and share that with you. Cheers. Quickly want to just mention, I drink the water throughout the day on top of this. So I hit 80 ounces, so that's a 40 ounce cup, two of those a day. I'll usually go above that, plus one of these cuppies. You know what I like? <clears throat> my big thing is like, does it work? Does it make me feel better? And does it taste dang delicious? Yes, on all fronts, so I'm all for it. I've taken it once in powder form, but if you need help with sleep, it's called, it's, it's snoozeberry flavor and it comes in like a little pack. Just helps you sleep in a natural way. Let me nerd out with you. Some of you might not care about this, but when I saw this hack, I freaked out. So let me show you. Part of the glow up challenge is gonna ha be to have a spot to write out like goals, manifestation, gratitude, like stuff like that. And part of mine, at least you can, by the way, the list, you can pick and choose what you wanna do. You don't have to do everything. So, but once you choose, you commit for four months, right? September, October, November, December. Yes, the final four months, it's the final four. So I have my dream book, which I shared in a prior video. It's all like house stuff and I don't know if you know this, I've mentioned it a couple times, but I studied architecture in school. And so I love a good floor plan. I'm going somewhere with this, don't you worry. And this can be for anything, by the way. I saw this the other day and the person was drawing comic books. They weren't drawing floor plans, but I thought, 
floor plans. And this is way cheaper. As a girl that did go to school and bought all of the expensive, like parchment, not, not parchment paper, tracing paper. This is parchment paper, which was I think a whopping $3, but wait, but wait. There's a grid. There's like a smart grid on this parchment paper. So to draw a floor plan, which basically it's also see-through, cause I love like envisioning like where the rooms are gonna go. So now I have a grid and you can do your scaling too. Like if you're doing a floor plan for a dream home, you could do like one, I think it's like an inch by an inch. So you could do like an inch is equal a foot or however you wanna do that. You don't even have to get that fancy. You might need a Sharpie cause it is wax, but it doesn't matter cause it's cheaper. I don't know. I just thought this was like the coolest freaking thing. Cool, right? You know what would work better than a pencil would work good on this. May I suggest if you're working on your goals and I'm gonna go through this live on my Instagram. So headed into, <laughs> <laughs> like what can I be? Headed into a fresh four months. This is what I usually do. I've done this all year long so far. So I've shared this before I had my own workbook. I was like, I love a workbook on a plane. Keeps me distracted, keeps me busy. I watch a movie, glass of wine or champagne, and I map out my dreams. So I'm gonna go through this from now until September 1st. So if you wanna start with me, but I'm gonna go through this entire workbook. Every single page is different. Um, you go through 10 chapters from setting boundaries to figuring out your goals to, and question that I get the most about this is, do I have to like know what my goal is? No, the point is, is if you are lost AF and you don't know where the heck to go with your life, this will help you and motivate you and get you. That's the other thing. If you lack motivation, this will give you clarity to give you the motivation. So Dream Life Blueprint, that's on the Daily Grind website. It's one of our products. Have like some sort of a thing to keep your your notes, your gratitude. That's something I would suggest that's on the list. Um, I just use the blank dot grid insert that we just got as well as the habit tracker and I track everything I'm doing. And that's gonna be something that's part of my glow up. It's super easy to do. It takes me two seconds and I'm gonna write out things that I'm grateful for, but also what I'm manifesting post meditation, which will also be on the list. And I just do quick five minute meditation that I find on YouTube, super simple. So I figured you'll be a part of the whole day. This makes a lot of coffee in case you wanted to know. <laughs> Full kettle of water. And then this sits for, how long do it, does this sit for? Two to three minutes. And then in that time, I'll make my creamer. We're still doing summer mugs. When we come back, the summer mug, <gasps> when we come back, the summer mugs are gonna be done. Actually, when we come back, I don't know if we're gonna have a house. So <laughs> let's not talk about that. Good morning, hi, how are you doing? Would you like a puppuccino? <clears throat> so anyways, yesterday I talked about have your supplements nearby. I'm probably gonna put these in like a little, do we have a little cute container? This little, get yourself a cute little container. So I just do a little bit of creamer. I get it, not healthy, I don't care. It's French vanilla, it's delicious. And we're gonna make it into a beautiful collagen recipe. Okay, so I have a little bit of cream. I'm coming, Carl, I see you. We have, we look like a barista right now. It's one thing to take all these things, but if you organize yourself, you'll be that much more likely to take it. So I'm gonna get rid of this bag. See, now I'm ready. So I'm gonna put this in here for like easy grabbings. That's a big one. You ready? Hey, can you do a sit pretty? You're not before that. Do you wanna do a little roll? <laughs> what was that? Can I kiss? Thank you. <laughs> High five and I'll lay down. everybody your butt. You just kind of like pour that on top and it makes a fancy coffee. Look at you. It's a smiley face. It's hard Thank to tell, you. but it's there. Increases tone hydration firmness while reducing cellulite. It wouldn't be an Angie morning without lighting a candle. So here we go. This part might not be fancy, but you need to be a part of it. Okay, this is really not fancy. This is the most basic budget product. So I got this when I was like a kid because I had acne and then ever since then I've used it and it's my favorite exfoliator. I stopped using it for like a little bit and I came back to it recently. It's like the most clean feeling ever. I'm sure that there's better ones. And the reason I do this is because my skincare is way more potent if you exfoliate. So that's what we're doing. So it's just tea tree and I love it. The whole point of the headband is to not get your hair wet, Angie. Fresh, clean, exciting. This is it, nothing fancy. Body shop, oldie but a goodie. From there, I usually come in here. I have like a three-step 
skincare regime, but I'm gonna take you through everything and I'm gonna show you my tools. One thing that I've noticed on my skincare journey is First of all, my skin has, I'll pop up like a transformation. So this would have been after about two weeks, like a little bit over two weeks, which is wild to see that level of difference. But you guys know I love the sun and the way that it feels too is just very, very smooth. So here's what had happened. I was notorious for buying $50 range skincare and then not liking it, not using it, it collecting dust in my drawer. And I went through this with cleaning out the house and I was like, you know what? I need quality that's actually gonna do something and make a difference specifically for like sun damage and just evening out the skin and tone and like getting glowing hydrated skin. So I was like, I'm investing in a good product. We're gonna find one, we're gonna do our research. And my girlfriend was doing this and I didn't believe her at first. And then I saw her results, which I think she'll be okay if I share them, love her. So I got it because of her and it's amazing. And so I think the only reason that I would ever share this with you guys is one, it actually works because I get it. It's pricey and it's an investment, but I added up like how much I was spending on these like 40, $50 serums, creams. And so that would be like $150 purchase. And then I was doing it more than once. And I was like, it's the same thing. And, and um, we're not going to see the dermatologist anymore either because it's not necessary. So this is step one. By the way, the other reason I'm sharing this, I would never share this without a code because I'm like, uh, I wouldn't pay this full price. So we're getting them a discount code. I've worked at the company. I am now affiliated with them because I believe in it and it's good. And the discount code is hefty. It's 20% off, off of like a big ticket item like that. That's solid. So this is like the spot treatment. I have melasma on my upper lip a little bit. Um, I've talked about it before, a little bit self-conscious about it. The thing is with me, like the back balance with like going in the sun. And I also, this has SPF in it. One of these, the third step has SPF. So this is step one. I just do a spot treatment. But the thing with me with the spot treatment is I put it everywhere and then paired with the exfoliant before. So I got the, I'm going to turn it into a four step system. I mean, it'll still be the same. I'm just going to wash my face in Florida. I ordered the, I think this speaks volumes too. I ordered the whole set for Florida because I love it that much. I use my own code. Um, so I'll show you exactly what I got. I got all these things I'm going to show you and I got the soap. By the way, um, the reason that it's this color is it's all made from, it's the most potent skincare on the market. It's all plant. It's not plant-based, it's just plants, which is wild. Um, so zero toxins, zero, zero fragrances, which I love that. It kind of smells like, like rosemary. I would say a little bit of like vitamin C smell. It smells like a garden. It's very potent though. I love the smell. Like to me, it smells super clean. I'm all about it. So I just tap that on and then I do any other sun spotted areas and the tingles means like the first day I used it when it started tingling, I was like, okay, it's working. And if you don't want it to tingle as much, don't exfoliate your skin right before, like let it, let the pores close back up. To me, I'm just like, I'm a sucker for it. I'm like, burn away, tingle away. That's the spot treatment. It's called the cure spot treatment. This is step two, serum. There's serum. This is like the fun part. I didn't know this until after. There's serum level one, two, or three. Obviously start with one, but the idea is you can progress up as your skin gets more and more used to the tingles. So this one is like a golden color. This one is basically for like fine lines, wrinkles, glowing, even skin texture. And this step I do a little bit differently. So once the spot treatment is in, you can do it the other way. I just, I like doing it this way. I pat this in and then you can do like a facial massage with your hands. Oh, and you, what I like to do with the extras, I rub it on the top of my hands because the top of your hands will have some damage also. You can either do like a facial massage. I shared this in, I think my stories. You can do like using your knuckles, you can do that. You can use a gua sha. This is just a piece of jade stone. They're like $5 off of Amazon and you can like go along your jawline. So before you do that, and I'm gonna show this in the one, two, one glow up challenge. I'm gonna show exactly how to do this, but I'll give you like a little tutorial. So I usually will like pump my lip, lymph nodes. It doesn't need to be anything crazy and get everything. This is, this is the point of drinking all the water, by the way, so you can flush all this out after. Pump everything, most important part, and then I go three passes. I've been doing this forever and I swear it's made such a difference in my jawline and like depuffing my face. And I do this over top of the serum and right up to my earlobe too. And you can do over your eyebrows with like one of the edges. And then I always end it with the back of my ears and I just kind of pull everything down to like get everything moving. So this will help with um, blood circulation and drainage. And then you drink a crud ton of water. The other thing that I've done and this, so this would be like Hands would be level one, this would be level two, so like five bucks. This baby is incredible. There's three levels to this and you have to have the serum on your face. Don't do it on a dry face. And you just do the same kind of movement. It'll basically heat up your skincare and it tightens your face. So same thing, cheekbone, jawline. Let's go to level two. Oh, you feel it. You can feel the tingles. It'll last me a while. Like it's 
pricey, but it'll last you. So I got the 50 ml, there's different sizes too. The number two, and then I got the cream, this is step three. So this is what I've been using instead of makeup. I haven't been wearing makeup at all. It comes as like an orange tinted color. Again, all natural, all plants. There's SPF 50 built into here. It is lab tested as the most hydrating cream on the market. It smells so good. I think that's my favorite product. It's hard to tell. I like all three. And can you do, I know I'm gonna get this question, like can I do just one? Yeah, you can literally, you don't have to do any of it if you want to. I just shared the things that I love. Is it lost upon me that it's expensive? No, never. That's why I wanted to get your discount code. Do you have to do it? No. Have I tried it for two weeks and love it? Yes. Can I stay quiet about it? No, I have to share things I love. Mm. So that's my three steps. Now you're part of it. So that's what I plan on doing every single day headed into September 1st. So that's why I have it for Florida. Now did we rub it all the way in? Then I do a lip mask. I linked a bunch of like all the tools, lip mask. I'm gonna put on a serum on my eyelashes. That's something that's definitely gonna be part of the glow challenge. Super easy to do and it makes a difference. I'm gonna link all of these products in my Amazon storefront for you guys. So it's all there under the glow up section. So lip mask, and then I'll usually do, I don't always do brows, but I'll do brows. This is a new one. I just finished my Charlotte Tilbury one. Eyelash serum. Don't, by the way, don't just buy any eyelash serum on Amazon. I feel like that's risky business. Eyelash curler, and then mascara, and that's it. So this to me is like the perfect balance, which is why I definitely wanted it in Florida. And all I'm gonna do is mascara, brows. I mean, I wanna get like a brow gel, I feel like that would be easier. I can't wait. I just want to say like the glow up challenge, like I'm just, I was going to do it on my own. So like, I'm just excited you guys are doing it with me, but I'm excited that this, these habits amplified. If you're watching this at any time of the year, just pick your start date and go for four months. That's the one, two, one challenge, four full months. I mean, my skin on New Year's Eve is going to be amazing. Okay, so I'm just getting ready. And I just very transparently shared this on my Instagram. Also, we're packing. I'm trying to figure out what I want to bring with me to Florida, if anything. I'm just gonna put on like a little sweater with this dress. Here's, I'll just shoot it to you straight. This is what I said on Instagram. I have a code for this company. Let's not be those people that use the code for the company. I'm not giving it to you. Can we just support her? So this lady, she's so sweet and so talented. She lives in Maui. I checked on her last night. She's doing okay. She's on the other side of the island. She, she said that she can ship stuff, but because there's no tourists or anything, it's definitely affecting business. And obvi for obvious reasons, like everything else is affected. I know that she has a lot, a lot of like cool things going on on her Instagram. Like I saw it yesterday. She did like a donation. And so it's Bootsy Oil. Because part of the one one challenge and the timing of this, I was like, it was on the list. I was just gonna let you pick, but now I'm kind of, I'm gonna impose my will a little bit. So on the list, I was gonna say, pick one signature scent for yourself, like one perfume, whatever that is, and stick to it for the full challenge so that you have like one signature scent. Uh, pick one of these. Like they, there's tons of them, they smell amazing. So she's based in Maui and she posted this. Mahalo to everyone who ordered from Bootsy.com this weekend, you helped raise. $1,033 for helping Maui. So go to her website. I'll link it down below. It's called Bootsy Oil. You can check out her Instagram too. This is the one that I have. I have like the original pink one. I'm placing like a substantial order like right now myself. These are the other ones. This is called Colada and it's called Tropique. They all smell amazing. And then there's cream. I'm just going to go get all the things. I think I'm, if you just want to know what I'm going to go with, this one. So I was going to just make this my signature scent anyways and share it. But now I'm like, I think that we should all go help. A little bit of love, spread some love. She's an absolutely amazing human being and so talented. And she said she's okay to ship and all the things. So go enjoy and go support and spread a little bit of love and leave her some love on her page too. Okay, I'm going to brunch. I smell delish. I'm gonna put more on. Oh, and I shared this on Instagram too. If you put it on before you work out or like on a hot day and you sweat, your husband may or may not be like, what are you wearing? It's like, literally it's like man trap. It's like an oil based. Time for breakfast. Back from brunch. We're gonna be comfortable while we clean. This is my cleaning outfit. We're ready. We're gonna start on the top floor. By the way, I got no footage at brunch. I was distracted. We enjoyed, I had pancakes. It was great. Carl's best friend is a, I don't even wanna get his weight wrong. Definitely over 100 pounds. He's gigantic. I'll pop up a picture of Carl and Tony. Do you love Tony? Your best friend at camp? I think Carl associates associates himself as a big dog. You identify. You identify as a big dog. You have big dog energy. <laughs> We're gonna start top to bottom. Just one final round of cleaning before we leave and the house gets shown, like dusting, tidying up, also packing and all the things. Um, one thing I wanted to mention with breakfast and just like the glow up challenge, I'm gonna be like switching up my diet a little bit. While we will be in Disney, like that's not easy, 
but I'm gonna follow like an 80-20 diet, nothing crazy. Um, I'll probably put together some sort of a meal plan for myself, so I'll include that in this month's toolkit also for subscribers on Instagram, so you guys have that. I always try to include like workouts, habits. This month's gonna be bigger because we're doing the glow up, so the toolkit will be robust this month. So I think I'm gonna start in here, go once more through all my drawers, probably at this point get rid of any other skincare that I've purchased because I'm not gonna use it. I'm just gonna have those three bottles right here. This was another skincare set that I had got that I'm not gonna use, so I'm probably gonna give it to Carl's trainer as a gift like right now. Like this is what I mean, like that was probably like $100. So if you're adding up like all these times that you're getting just like random skincare and not using it, it does add up. Yeah, watch me, watch me purge. This would be a fun game. These are resurfacing pads. I haven't used them. I'll keep one of these. I haven't used this. Solid, Angie. And I'm sure I'm not alone in this. I would guess around 40 to 50 bucks, probably 30 bucks, probably 30 bucks, probably 25 bucks, probably 25 bucks, probably 30. I don't know, like 20 something, 30. Probably very expensive, probably like 50. This whole set I think is pretty expensive. This was like 30 bucks. Like that's what I mean. Like how much mediocre skincare are you collecting instead of just having like a few quality pieces? And I think that that goes for everything. That's kind of like the life lesson that I've learned over the past little while. This company scares me because the last time that I had their, that I moved away from this company. I'll just tell you because uh, it truly happened. Sunday Riley. I loved their cream and I bought one and it was moldy and it freaked me out. Um, not just because it was moldy, but I brought it back and Sephora refused to take it back, which is very rare because they said that the, I had had it for longer than six months or something like that. And I was like, okay, but it's moldy. And they were like, nothing we can do. And I was like, cool, noted. So that was fun. <laughs> and it just makes me kind of like not trust the brand. Eye cream, They're tossing that. Another eye cream, tossing that. This one's expensive, same brand, tossing that. And I'm not tossing anything, I'm just gonna give it away. Oh, we are clean in house. This is all the skincare and beauty products that I'm giving away. I have these lashes that I'm not using. So how I said that I'm doing a scent for like my own scent, like a perfume, I wanna do a scent for my home also, like one signature scent. And I feel like for me, on the times that like I'm the most happiest, when the house is smelling like good, but also fresh and clean, I mean, you saw the candle, so we can't talk about that. That's probably gonna be my signature scent. But this is something that like, I just wanna get in the habit of doing. It's just a natural oil, it's called Refresh. I could reach out to them and see if they would get me a discount code for you guys. I love this company, it's called Sage. This smell is just kind of like peppermint, eucalyptus. It says like awakening blend. It just smells very clean. Spearmint, lavender, lemon. There's gotta be, yeah, eucalyptus. It just smells really good. So I just put a couple little drops in a nebulizer and I have nebulizers all over the house and it just kind of leaves your house smelling very fresh and very clean. Is it because you know that you're going to camp? It's our last moments together, my love, for a few weeks. You're very handsome. I'm going to miss you. And then when I rewatch this, when we're, I'm not with you, I'm going to cry. Oh, Carly's so beautiful. Carl's the most handsome little baby ever. A little potato. You're going to have fun. I'm going to miss you though. I'm going to miss you. And cue the comments about everybody being like, why can't Carl come to Florida? <laughs> that happens every time. I wish Carl could come to Florida. Are we going to glow up together? Mommy's going to be so glowed up by the time you see her again. We're going room by room. This room is pretty much done. I think I'm just going to dust a little bit. And then I'm just going to close the door once I'm done. Bless you. <laughs> and then we're going to do Andre's office is pretty much clean. Carl's washroom might need to be a little bit tidied up. And we're just going to move room by room. Okay, a package just came in. I think I'm missing like two things, but I got the cloud collection pieces. I decided to go with like the gray. I don't wear, I'm gonna just put it over this cause this could kind of be like a bodysuit, which is how I would wear this. I need like, j bless you. I need like just cozy sweatpants and I don't have any. And these are really soft. These are Buff Bunny, obviously like all the athletic wear that I wear is Buff Bunny. <gasps> I mean, it's not lost upon me. It's not sexy, but I'm not here for sexy. I'm here for comfortable. Do we do like this? And then this is like a bolero. I have this in black and I love it. Maybe I'm gonna fly with this tomorrow. Oh God. <gasps> Babe, can you look at my outfit and tell me like, do is it like too track panty? Track pantsy? Is this cute? It looks comfortable. It looks, uh, it looks. It's, it's cute, it's cute. But it looks like something you can live in like every day. I think no, I- No, but is it like it or is it like, am I, I so cute? 
Thank you. Like as a flying outfit for tomorrow. I like that idea. Yeah. With my like with some nice Nikes. <gasps> no, with my Mickey sneakers. Boom. Right. Me trying to be fashionable. I'll never be fashionable. This is comfortable. I feel like I should get like, there's like a taupe color. I think there's, I think the pants come in black too. These don't compress. I don't like compression, okay? Like don't compress my tummy, especially right now. Just let my tummy be like free. And also, can we just normalize that? Like seriously, I think it's ridiculous. Like just because someone is like bloated or floofy doesn't mean that they're with child. <laughs> So oh, thank you. Okay, what was I doing? I came down here to make a juice. I think I would even size up a little bit so that the sleeves could be longer. Cause I just, I like, as you can tell, I have like stretch arms. You know that rule in school when you had to go like this for your skirt? Yeah, I always failed that one. See, I have my little bin now. You were a part of this yesterday, so now you know what I'm doing. You want me to make you a juice too? The tang, please. The, only the tang or you want like the purple with the tang? Um, seriously, I bet you if you try probiotic, you're gonna want one every day. No. <laughs> oh, hello. Here, you wanna try? Really, a pixie stick. Okay, and is it dissolving? Yeah, it's, it's like candy, right? It's really good. Oh, there's more. Yeah, it's really good. Mm-hmm. Good. Yeah? Mm-hmm. What's the flavor? Peach. Mm-hmm. I like it. Purple, pre-workout first. Mm. It'd be so pretty if it would make like an ombre. Ma'am. See you later. See you See you later. We're gonna be able to ride that soon. Funny story. The first time I ever rode Flight of Passage in Disney World, I almost backed out because I was so nervous. I don't know. I was just really scared. I get really nervous for new rides, except for Tron. Tron, I was like, I was so excited. Okay, so Avatar almost backed out. I was in that room where they like, if you've never rode it, there's like this room where they basically explain what's gonna go on like they do for every ride. And there's a part where she's like, some of this ride may be intense. And I, at that point I'm like, I'm out. Like in my head, I was like, I can't do this. Like I'm out. And then she goes, some of this ride might be intense, but, and then right away I was like, and she's like, but rise to the occasion, trust your guide and be brave. Sivako. And I'm like, Sivako. We've got this. I'm so nervous. And I get out of the ride. Audrey, this is your favorite story. I get out of the ride and Audrey was like, did you keep your eyes open the whole time? Cause he told me like, if you're scared, just close your eyes. Cause it's a motion simulator. So I, I thought I kept my, I was like, I kept my eyes open the whole time. And he's like, really? Even when we went upside down, I'm like, we went upside down. I did keep my eyes open the whole time. Let's get some sun, baby. It's time to go. lunch i feel like the house is ready i mean it'll never be ready enough and i just went and cleaned up downstairs how clean is the garage i just cleaned up our storage room this looks good i mean i just want to make a statement from the houses that andre and i have toured of the like 40 and he, he watched my video and he was like just so you know we saw five houses twice three of them Mol no sorry three of them three times like we and he's like we probably toured about 50 houses so and we've seen some like some people are like messy. So I'm like, well, at least we're making an effort. Like some people, they just don't care. They're like, here's my house, buy it if you want it, which I wish I could be like that. So I'm trying to make sure everything's like NCO. Here's the storage room. I have one box packed. That's all my YouTube stuff. I put away like my keepsake stuff. I'm gonna put this in my luggage cause it makes me happy. And I just cleaned up the gym. Ooh, Andre Belmar did a good job. He's like, I didn't do that good of a job. I'm like, 
We'll see. Now that's a garage. He wants to know if he should get rid of this, like move it. That should come inside though, because that is a hot, weird, nope, nope. Every, to all of you that asked if I bought it, yes, I did. And it will be part of the not so scary. We're just gonna sit and have cocktails and make this. She's my baby. We're ready. Dear Lego, please partner with me in my conquest of being, you know what I wanna do in my heart of hearts as I get older, I would like to be a Lego influencer as well as, I told my best friend this and she laughed out loud so I'm just gonna tell you guys. I would like to be a roller coaster tycoon and Sims influencer as well. And just spend my days playing roller coaster tycoon. I used to be really good at it when I was younger. I haven't played it in like years. He organized my bins. He did so good. Look how pretty that is. It looks like a store. A little bit of Halloween. Like that's for the porch. Valentine's day, summer, and then the rest is all Christmas. You did so good. I did. goo. I was just trying to minimalize. Okay, I feel like we just improved that. This is just our diplomas. You're welcome. You are welcome. Oh, there's more. I think when we were dating, we were in, Andre, you're gonna die. What'd you find? Remember we had this done in Disney? Oh my God. It was under our diplomas. Wait, remember we got this done in Vegas? Yes. What was with us in doing caricatures? You look so cute in this. That one doesn't look like you at all. This one? Yeah, it doesn't, it I look, doesn't like, look like me. I look like a baby. I meant to, I just thought of this. So I want to make sure I'm going through the entire glow up list because that's the point of this vlog. Whitening toothpaste. I just ordered some for Florida. I'll link it down below, but a smoker, I know it's weird, smokers or a coffee drinkers toothpaste. I don't think we talked, we might've talked about it. Can you tell we're going to Disney? We're so excited. We woke up this and we're like, we're going to Disney World. I just did my skincare and I am floored. Or I shared a before and after photo. I didn't even want to take the before photo and here we are, two and a half weeks later. By the way, can you hear the knees not cracking? That's what happens when you take care of your body, you drink collagen, glowing skin, healthy joints. So I'm just packing, making the bed this morning. My flying outfit, can we address the flying outfit? I can't wear light gray track pants today because day one of my ish. And although they would be comfy, I, mean, I am gonna order the black ones though. I just checked and they're still in stock. And I, those are the most comfortable track pants I have ever seen in my life. And I want to get the shorts too. Let's look inside my luggage without giving too much away because I don't want you to see everything. I packed all my jewelry. I don't know when we're coming home. Well, I do, but if we don't have a place to live when we come home, I wanted to make sure I had all my stuff. I bought this because you guys told me to. Literally just because you guys told me to. I always complain in Florida that my phone kind of like goes dark. Does this happen to you if you're like in the sun, sun, sun worshiping like me, and then you're, you can't see what's on your phone? You guys told me to buy this. It's the most Angie-esque thing I've ever seen. Where's my phone? <laughs> Things you don't need. This is so freaking cute. This, the sun is sunning today. I'm so sorry for showing those Aldo shoes, the Disney Aldo shoes, they're all sold out. I showed them on my Instagram and everybody's like, why are you showing this, it's sold out. I'm like, I didn't know. I'm gonna make the bed and then I will recap the one, two, one challenge. I will drop the prep link down below, down some water, we'll head to the airport. We just took the thumbnail, Andre helped me right here. So I changed into like my cute workout slash travel outfit. I just really don't feel confident wearing light colored pants on a flight. I just don't think that it makes a lot of sense today of all days, but I will pack them and I'm gonna wear them tomorrow. We are almost headed out. Thank you so much for being a part of this with me. Um, I will link every single thing that I talk about. And just a reminder, one, you guys are amazing and I know that you know this. There, I don't use filters on my Instagram ever. Nobody has ever, like, <laughs> there's such an amazing audience on here that nobody has ever even asked that. But just a reminder, like I would never do that if I'm talking about like skin or whatever. I have no makeup on my face right now, except for my skincare. I did my eyebrows and I have mascara. That's like my new thing. And then my lip mask. So I'll give you guys the whole list of everything. The other thing I just want to say is everything I'm sharing is a suggestion. The biggest question I get in the comment section or in my DMs is always, where did you get X, Y, and Z? Clothing, this. I love to share. I've been like this since I'm little. When my friends would come over, I'd be like, look at my toy. Like I would always 
always be like that. So I love to share and I love not gatekeeping and sharing all the secrets. So if something works for me, obviously I'm going to share it. And I've been getting inundated with DMs lately. And it means the world that you guys are like, wait, your skin, what? And people are like, your skin was always good, but like, what? So obviously I'm going to share. I'm not just going to be like, oh, I did nothing. And it's has nothing to do with injectables. I am like on a mission to never do that again in my life. The last time I got, I got baby Botox up here in early January, never doing that again. Cause far too many people are getting like scary situations. I don't want that to happen. Also, we're going to go the natural route. I've never done laser, not super interested. So this is just cream which is wild to me that it's all natural and plants and all of that. Paired with the collagen and my little pre-workout drink, I'm a happy gal. So I will share all the links. So I'm gonna change into my leggings, but Buff Bunny, the other one, I think it's still in stock. I'm literally gonna go order it right now. Um, but yeah, I always share stuff just because I love it. It's never to like pressure you or make you feel, hopefully you don't feel that way. I do always try and get a discount code. I either reach out to the company and let them know that there's people that really want it and there's a high demand for it. And if they can provide one, that's great. I'm trying to work on one for a hair serum right now. And I think I'm gonna be able to get that for you guys. It's like my favorite hair serum ever. So we're all about the glow up from September 1st till the end of the year, or whenever you choose to start this. But basically it's 121 days four months. We're going all in final four months of the year for me, at least I'll see you guys in Disney long overdue. I can't wait to share all the Halloween content. Thank you to everybody for being so sweet and so supportive. And I mean this from the bottom of my heart, you guys actually really did help with the last video. Those will not happen probably ever again in my lifetime, <laughs> fingers crossed, but that was emotional. It's been an emotional couple of weeks and I just, your support has not gone unnoticed. It truly means the world. And I don't know if everybody realizes this, my dishwasher is loud. I don't know if you realize this whenever like people are online, like I'm a real person too. I'm a human. And I think that sometimes when people are on the internet, either on stories or on camera like this, like on YouTube, it's kind of, you almost become like disassociated with that. Like they're not an actor. I'm, I'm a real person. And I love that you guys know that. And the other day I commented, someone commented under my post and she wrote like, where is her video? And I said, or where is her video? She posts in so many different areas. And I wrote, hi, she is me. My video is on YouTube. Like I answer my own comments. Like I'm a human. And I think that sometimes we get disassociated, but everything that I'm sharing is real. Everything I'm going through is real. Everything I love is things I truly love and is real. And I think that's the best way to go about it, which is why I love the new format of these vlogs. They're longer. They're super transparent, super real, raw, unfiltered. I'm all about that life. So thank you for being all about it with me. And that's me done, me being done being sappy. Okay, love the crap out of you guys. Don't forget to subscribe because Disney content is coming and Halloween is coming. And there's some really exciting secrets being unleashed in the next little bit. Like you're not even ready for what's coming. Like I, I, mm, 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 I already shared enough. Mm -mm. Nope, nothing. I love you guys and I will see you next time in Disney. Bye you guys.